Okay, we're going to try again. I had to take the extruder apart. I had a piece of plastic broken off in it. I'm sure that was my doing. Temperature's at 138. And climbing. I do now have the filament through the extruder. I'm sorry, I cannot get the camera at an angle to show that. I've run it up over the top of the printer. And the rest is lying piled or coiled up on the floor. Right there. I'll have to watch what I'm doing here. And I'll roll over it. Right, 174 degrees. Do you have any drippage? It looks like maybe. Yeah, that looks like drippage. Excellent. That means the uh, nozzle's not clogged, which is good. I ended up taking the nozzle off. And ended up pulling out a chunk. That chunk right there. That was stuck. That had broken off the extruder. I think it was my fault. I'm hoping this is not going to be a common occurrence. Okay, so everything says it's ready. We're hovering at 197 to 199. And let's hope the hell this one works. See if we don't tear the tape off this time. Not getting anything out. Oh, no, there it goes. I may have to run this print job again. I don't think it was ready. But hey, what the hell? It's running a print job. I'm sure there's a way to tell the printer to extrude some plastic in order to prepare it for use. Okay, I can tell right away my steps are too short. Or I'm having it extrude way too much plastic at once because my centimeter square cube is looking kind of blobularly. Blobuly. It's not pretty. Okay. I think we're just going to go ahead and let this run. If nothing else, it needs to run anyway. Again. The little fan is not hooked up. We're running fairly short print jobs. I don't think it's going to matter a lot. Um, on the upside, this thing seems to be able to pull the plastic through even though the coil is on the floor. Not an ideal situation. But hell, this is just testing. Get past the testing, then I can worry about that. Well, there's definitely a height here. I mean, this is not an ideal print job. I'll tell you that right now. But it is growing taller. The fact that it's printing anything at all is just way too cool. We've got the X motor on the other side of the printer currently. You have to keep that away from the wall. It gets mighty hot. And I accidentally touched the extruder while I was cleaning the mess up, even though it had been off a while. It was still pretty warm. So uh, I'll touch one of those. Okay. I think we're nearing the end of our print job. It's, to be fair, it does look like a cube, even though the base of the cube looks pretty sorry. Let's see how it treats that top layer. I'm actually kind of curious about that. Alrighty, there she be. I'll get that off the printer and I'll give you a progress report.